And staying with the South, the security guard who was run into with a hammer by an enraged businessman in Kerala is in critical condition. Amid public outrage, the chief minister, Oman Chandi, has pledged that the police will not be lenient and strictest punishment under the law will be ensured. The businessman has been arrested for attempt to murder. He's been sent to 14 days of judicial remand till now. 47-year-old Chandra Bose, security guard of a posh residential complex in Trishur, now critical in ICU with multiple fractures after a businessman's merciless show of strength. He is brewing. So we will keep the patient a little more time so that he will become more and more stable. So we will transfer the patient for CT. The man who did this to Chandra Bose is Mohammed Nisham, a Trishur-based businessman. Enraged because there was a delay in opening the gate to his residential complex, Nisham beat him repeatedly and then rammed his hammer into him to stop him from fleeing. Then he beat him again. Police say Mohammed Nisham, who now is arrested for attempt to murder, has a history of run-ins with the law and apparently getting away with it. He allowed his underage son to drive his Ferrari, allegedly locked up a woman constable in his car. There have been at least 10 police cases against him. He either settled them out of court or paid a fine. Chief Minister Oman Chandi has said this time it will be different. This is something different, very cruel. So in this case, uh, the police will take every step, every legal step against the culprit. The government is taking care of the medical expenses of the security guard. The scene of crime here is not part of any Bollywood script. The gory scenes of blood stains, of broken tiles after a rich man's hammer rammed into a security guard who then was mercilessly beaten, stinks of the reality of abuse of wealth and rage. And of course, a huge opportunity for the guardians of law to regain the confidence and faith of the common man. With camera person SP Babu, Sneha Koshi for NDTV from Trishul.